So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran, very well known verse, we hear it all the time, pertaining to us now. Allah says in Surah Al Imran, chapter 3, verse 104. وَلْتَكُمْ مِنْكُمْ أُمَّةٌ يَدْعُونَ إِلَى الْخَيْرِ يَعْمُرُونَ بِالْمَعْرُوفِ وَيَنْهَوْنَ عَنِ الْمُنْكَرِ وَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْمُفْلِحُونَ Allah says, let there be a group. Let there be a group. مِنْكُمْ Allah is telling you, we should. And why did he say that? Because here yeah, there may be some people involved in this and that and whatever, not in sleeping, eh? in different aspects. Some people may be seated and teaching 24-7. Some people may be there to lead Salah five times a day. But Allah is saying here, minkum ummatun yad'una ilal khair. That and from amongst you, there should be a group who will take the responsibility of spreading the message. Ya'muruna bil ma'roof wa yanhauna anil munkar. And joining what is good and forbidding what is evil. And then he says, wa ulaika humul muflihun. And they are the people who will be successful who will attain that success how many of us really do that you don't lead salah five times a day that's not your full-time job we don't sit and teach quran five times a day that's not our job but yet we don't invite people to islam we don't make the time to spread the message allah is telling us this is a command in the quran 